This is my third collaboration with the group Creative Arts Collaboration. This month's theme and tag is hashtag trust to treasure. I can't wait to see what the other members have recycled and made. Ever wonder what you can do with these hole punches left over from your hole punch? And all these scrap paper pieces left over from when I cut 8x10 and paper for my ACO? Well, I'll show you two ways now. The colour on the barrel isn't always the same as what comes out on the paper. In this case, sometimes it is also useful to keep a swatch of your art supplies. Colour the dots with a pen, in this case, Pro Marker. Wait for the alcohol marker to dry a bit and glue the back of the hole punch paper. Stick the coloured dot onto the pen lid like this. For this bit I found a basket I was storing bits and bobs in and put it sideways like this. Store the pens horizontally so they do not dry out and so you can see the coloured lids. This makes it easier to see the colour when you pick them out. Here you see me drawing a circle and putting glue around it so I can stick the whole punched paper to it. I arranged the pieces using a blunt pencil and my fingers. It was very fiddly to do so. 
originally set out to do a dandelion clock, as I worked on it, it became more apparent it would be more of a traditional flower. The dots were just the right size for this kind of flower. I arranged the pieces using a blunt pencil and my fingers. It was very fiddly to do so.